All right, and we have uh, two more spins now because Senior Cruz donated thirty dollars. Appreciate the support. Glad to have you here. So, we, and then Hader donated three, three, three. Thanks for being so generous, man, and supporting the cause. So now we have uh, two spins left to do. There's this. There's the wheel. We're almost through all the options on the wheel. All right. All right, now I have to play a game of Hearthstone with ice cubes down my pants for the entire duration. It just says ice cubes, so... Okay, three sounds good. Ah, jeez. I'm just glad I don't have to think about what to say. Honestly, we, we had, like, the wheel's been very unforgiving. We had, like, four exercise ones in a row, which then... Yeah, well... Okay. Whoa! Ah! Well, you were saying you were super warm earlier after the push-up. Ah! <laughs> Whoa, they're melting. It's distributing around the general pants area. We're mulligan for wild growth. Okie dokie. Because if you were standing up, they'd just slide right down your pants. I was hoping they would, yeah. No, now they're stuck in my lap. You, Yeah. You worked around the way that I tried to play around the system there. <laughs> they were super cold, but I was holding them. Uh, we're going to take the guardian animals. <laughs> Looking for a little bit more ramp. Maybe we can make it to it. Uh, ball for a good cause. All right, bonk beam. Not too bad here. All right, it's kind of... I'm coping with it a little. It's... A, yeah, my thighs are going numb. <laughs> what did you miss? I have ice cubes down my pants. <laughs> How's your day going? <laughs> have you ever shown up to work and then have people put ice cubes down your pants before? Wait, Ed, you actually had ice cubes down your pants at Omni before? That's funny. All right, well, it was getting better, but now it's getting colder again. It's kind of weird. I thought everybody was used to it, but like... All right, here we go. Mm, we still have enough guardian animals in the deck. Not too bad. Want to keep the health on the runner as high as possible, for sure. They're oh they shifted <laughs> Oh one fell It fell good, right? Oh it fell closer to the danger zone <laughs> I was kinda of balancing them on my thighs and now it's fully in the danger zone. <laughs> what is our freezer setting at? Like super cold? It is why would it be set colder than the stand? What is it? <laughs> Why do we have extra cold freezer mode on for this? This is. They're trying to get me killed. <laughs> yeah, we just send out a fiver. I just want to keep building things under the board, right? Doing nothing is too painful, but we saved the lake thresher, right? Just having a cleavy boy to rush in later sounds good. I need to play for next turn too. Uh, it successfully looks like I peed myself. So we're making progress on that front. That's true. Ooh, Overgrowth is a good draw here. Let's draw our cards first, obviously. But just getting some ramp finally. You love to see it. I think I take the healing. As long as we can make it long enough, we should win, right? So healing's good. Yeah, it's not too bad now. It's not too bad now. Now I'm just playing Hearthstone in wet pants. They're still... Oh, they're still there. They're still moving around. Okay. I was gonna say, can I stand up and show you the water stain? I don't know, that might be against the terms of sir. I'm not gonna stand up and show you the water stain. I don't need to get banned. <laughs> Alright, we play the... We're not under any pressure, so Ysera's great here. 
probably just taunt it up too to prevent these easy trades on these guys, make it a little bit annoying for him. And if he doesn't have a poly, that's how they got Soleil. Yeah, yeah. Ed's gonna have a lot of footage for YouTube to make fun of me with. This is probably gonna be some good YouTube videos coming out for the next, like, week. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, release the ice! Here we go! Get out of there. They were still, like, frozen. That is cold. Don't put them in my drinking water! Unless they were, um... I'm not drinking that water. That nasty. Here we go. Something easy. Not learn a card trick, because I don't want to learn anything. Pokemon. Costume number three. Is that donate to drink the water? I guess I could one. put drink the water on the list. Like a bib, like a lobster bib. Okay. How's the hand look, guys? I can't even see it. This is like a... My Godzilla? <laughs> oh my god, there's a mouth! Hey, okay, make it work. Okay. Nice. Then we gotta take out Jet. Okay. Ah! Okay. My mouth is bigger than Godzilla's, dude. Well, it's meant for a child. Ah! Yeah, are you scared of my dinosaur powers? All right, let's play, um, what haven't we played in a while? I've only played one game of Zoo so far, so let's hit up another game of Zoo. Oh, I keep bumping the microphone with my schnauzer. My dino schnauzer. The fire bat has become the fire dragon. Urgh. Machine? This is a professional player from the APAC region. Pretty cool. <laughs> tiny ears. I've got big head and tiny ears. I just run the, the I got a big head and tiny arms. Yeah. <laughs> I don't mind keeping the tour guide. A little bit of extra card draw is pretty good. I'm only gonna weigh the tour guide when I had to do push ups for every card I drew though. <laughs> okay. Easy flame. It's like I got a it's like I got a muzzle on. Yeah, it opens. Oh, I was gonna say we could make that like a mask that you just hear. Uh, now you guys can hear me better, oh, maybe. That looks awesome. That's it. What is it? That looks ridiculous. <laughs> rah, 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 rah. Which is the point? They are the most fashion conscious stream on all of Twitch, actually, I think. Yeah, this right. is high class fashion. It's going to be coming to a theater near you. Or a uh, fashion runway. What? This was $2? That's actually a bargain. That's well, good. Do we. The... The, the mask was a whole dollar? The mask was kind of a ripoff, but the other part's a pretty good deal. We can get double Zephyrs. Double Zephyrs is sick versus slow decks. And uh, he might be a slower warrior because he just armor passed. But he might still end up being bomb warrior, which would be a bummer. If he's bomb warrior, double Zephyrs, probably we don't have the time to do it. But if he's control warrior, double Zephyrs is going to be huge. So I, I like doing this instead of getting the tap in, you know. Yeah. No, no, I'm, I'm a chill dinosaur, but I think I still make their dinos go rawr. I know. Uh, we should have got like a laser pointer. I put it in. I pushed the bottom with my tongue and blah. <laughs> yeah, probably not. I wonder. All right, we don't need to extend anymore. He's he's gonna coin brawl, right? So I'm just chilling with this. He coin brawls, and hopefully we can raise dead some of these flame imps. We need to do a huge dark glare reload turn. He might not brawl. He might do like skipper, but same thing. Essentially, he's gonna get these dead, and we're gonna be able to replay them all with infinite mana with a dark glare. Yeah, yeah. It's, well, it's supposed to, right? Do you think Exodia Mage can be a thing in Standard with Potions of Illusion? Uh, I think if it ever ends up being a real thing in Standard, Blizzard's gonna nerf it. Blizzard hates uh, uninteractive decks like that. Just look at the Turtle Mage nerf. Anything that creates infinite loops and stuff like that, they're gonna try and get rid of. And generally, I think that's a good thing. Nice, nice, nice. One of these out there. Give him one of those. Oh baby, the giant. That was fun. Oh my gosh, we can stop the second brawl because the cult neophyte too came back from the revive. That was actually the most sick revive we could get there. 
Anonymous just gave his $60, so that's one more spin to the wheel. So it looks like this is not our last spin. We might actually get through all of the options. Yeah. That's good. I would have went for the off bread too. I can't tell the difference. That's true. Yeah, we might as well use the whole can. My jaw is tired. It feels like I've been at the dentist all day just having to keep my mouth open, you know? <laughs> I can't open it anymore. Well, you have like a really small mouth yeah, too. Yeah. Itty bitty. Easiest game of my life. Yeah, oh, of course not. So let's see. But we have to put Alarmobot in one of the decks now because of Moonlit's generosity. So I think Alarmobot's best suited for the Druid, right? So throw an Alarmo in here. It could, it could work. Or it's basically a wild growth. It's a budget wild growth. They're both ramp cards. Throw that in there. And then um, we spin the wheel and see what's going down. 